my family moved into this house in 1954, and we, uh, my mother and father raised five kids in a two-bedroom house, and we we managed, we made do with you know with a limited space, and uh, it was a challenge, but we, we made it happen. I stayed here all of these years because uh, I had some uh, tragedies in the family. Uh, my father passed away in 1978. My mother passed away in 1986, and so my my uh, sister had a son. He was only 11 years old, and she passed away. And he liked the area, so I stayed here to raise him until he finished high school and went to college. I have uh, my sister lives, lives here. Um, lives in, lives in the Grove, and uh, she had an injury, so I come to check on her sometimes. And I still have friends, like my best friend here, Ernest, and you know we we still you know connect with each other, and uh, I like the area. And what do you hope uh, comes out of this project? Well, I hope he uh, mains, maintains the decor and the facade of the building, and uh, just upgrade uh, the inside uh, and. Uh, Make it and put AC in it to make it a little more livable, you know, uh, you know, for, for people. And uh, hopefully uh, it can uh, revitalize the area and uh, keep, keep some of the uh, elderly people here. I think it's a good thing because uh, we need investment in the community and um, it's for uh, preservation and historical purposes. And... Um, help um, slow down some of the gentrification, <laughs> you know. <laughs>